very good morning to all okay in this video we'll see reconciliation of cost and financial account okay in the previous video dis we discussed about the techniques to solve and in this video we'll see the reconciliation problem with net loss yes uh, here we have the problem prepare a statement of reconciliation from the following the particulars was given um, net loss as per cost account net loss as per financial account okay here the net loss was given how we have to treat this net loss we'll see it in the problem okay and works overhead under recovered in costing administrative overhead recovered in excess depreciation recovered in costing and depreciation charged in financial account both the depreciation was given we have to compare this two and uh, we have to see whether we have to add the difference or to subtract the difference okay next one is interest on investment not included in costing okay it is there in uh, financial accounts only okay. next goodwill return of provision for doubtful debts in financial account stores adjustment credit in financial account loss of stocks charged in financial account okay in this problem the net lost as per cost account was given if you start with uh, this cost account loss we will array financial accounting loss okay and if we start with the financial accounting loss we will array cost accounting loss okay the other things remains the same here okay only the thing is uh, here we have loss okay the first step is that i'll start with cost account so the base is cost account i'm going to write net loss as per cost account okay here i'm writing it in bracket because uh, it is a loss so in order to highlight that i'll write it in bracket okay the next step is that i have to write net loss as per financial account okay ultimately i'm going to arrive this 40950 the next item is works overhead under recovered in costing here it is clearly mentioned that it is under recovered in costing expenses is under stated in cost book so that will increase the profit so in order to rectify that i have to subtract this so i'll write it in the subtraction column that is less the next item is administrative overhead recovered in excess okay this is expenses and it is in excess so this will reduce the profit so we have to add it here the next item is depreciation recovered in costing it's 11200 depreciation charged in financial account 12500 so here in both the books the depreciation was given in this case we have to find out the difference 12500 minus 11200 is 1300 okay and this 1300 is understated in cost book okay because here in cost book it is just 11200 in financial book it is 12500 so 100 stated expenses in cost book okay this will increase the profit so in order to rectify that we will subtract it the next item is interest on investment not included in costing okay this is an income and it is not there in costing so under stated income so this will reduce the profit so in order to rectify we have to add this the next one is goodwill return of and this is the expenses of financial account so in costing it is understated so understated expenses will increase the profit so here we have to subtract it next item is provision for doubtful debts in financial account okay this is also an expenses it is there in financial book so understated expenses in cost book so this will increase the profit so correct that we have to subtract it here next one is stores adjustment credit in uh, financial book okay it is credited na 
it is income and it is there only in financial book so income is understated in cost book so we have to add it here okay loss of stocks charged in financial account and uh, this is a loss and it is uh, understated in cost book so this will increase the profit so we have to subtract this here okay we uh, entered all the items in the reconciliation statement and it is the time for us to add the total and uh, find out the total of less items here uh, in add portion we have 3400 6950 uh, together it is uh, 10350 and in less column we have uh, 6240 1300 5000 1260 and 3000 so we'll have 16800 okay here we started with net loss so what have i have to do now we have to subtract this 10350 from 34500 because it is net loss we have to do it in reverse okay um, if we change the format it will confuse you so uh, no need to change the format okay uh, what all we'll do for the previous problem we'll do it here the only thing we'll uh, change it here is that we'll do it in the reverse way that is with net loss we will subtract the add total and uh, we will add the less total okay so that we will arrive this net loss as per financial account okay we have to just reverse the thing and do okay we have to uh, subtract this add total with this net loss as per cost account that is 34500 minus 10350 will gives 24150 and with that we have to add this less items that is 16800 okay we'll get 40950 this is the net lost as per financial accounts once again i'll repeat the steps of this reconciliation statement uh, first thing is that we have to fix the base whether we are going to start with the cost accounting profit or with the financial accounting profit that is the base and we have to think in that angle and we have to work out the problem the second step is that we have to identify the nature of the item that is whether it is an expenses or loss or uh, it is a income or gain that we have to identify and the third step is that whether the expenses or incomes are uh, overstated and uh, understated that we have to find it in the third step and if the expenses are uh, overstated and uh, incomes are understated it will reduce the profit we have to think the impact on profit so that will reduce the profit and we have to uh, add by rectifying this and uh, on the other hand if the expenses are uh, understated and incomes are overstated uh, that will give impact on uh, decreasing the profit so that case we have to subtract it on the other side if the expenses is uh, understated and uh, incomes are overstated uh, it will uh, give impact on increase in the profit so we have to subtract it here okay with this five steps we can easily solve any number of problems. Thank you for your patient listening.